Welcome back everyone. Welcome back to Let's Play Spin Tires Chernobyl DLC. We're in a convoy full of logs and we are delivering them to our destination, of course. Uh, which of course is there. It's not very far away actually, but I have a feeling there's going to be more radioactive stuff in between. We'll, we'll see what, what happens over here. Maybe so, maybe no. We'll see. Anyway, off we go. Convoy. Yeah. I do like how the logs are sort of moving about a little bit and such. I really enjoyed that they made the the truck beds and such have physics of their own as well. It's it's very nice, even though the physics sometimes go just haywire. What is that? Oh, there's some rocks there. Oh. Yeah, that wasn't the best idea, but we'll be fine. We actually crushed them. Get out of here, puny rocks! They crush you! There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. I should probably just go to low gear and uh, log the diffs. Because we would be using less... Well, about the same. Seven. Don't need the... Long diffs anymore, though. Oh. Yeah, it's gonna be radioactive here. Oh, it's actually, look. We're just skirting it. That's the end of it. Please don't smash into the... Ow! Oh, yeah, I did. Jeez. I think I played too much, uh... GTA and such, where you can just drive over all that stuff. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, camera is gonna go crazy, isn't it? Okay, you know what? I have to do something. Get rid of that. Do this. Okay, where is the radioactivity? Yeah, there's another pocket here. Uh, can we smash this ramp? Let's see. Ow. Yes, we can, but the other truck is gonna get stuck. Come on, come on. No, oh god, we're doing so much damage. It's ridiculous. I was hoping he would take it. No, come on. I don't need that damage right now. I really don't. Come on. Ow. Ow. Eight. Ten. Eleven. This is not good. But we're gonna go back to the garage soon anyway. Okay, let's just get out of here. Yeah. Okay, so where are we? Okay, we're actually here. So I suppose we could just take this road and go to the logs then. Yeah, I was hoping the truck in the back would actually um, take a wider turn. Because you can see that it's not really taking very wide turns. It's, it's just sort of following us straight up, which is not perfect. It's not great, but oh well. We're actually running a bit low on fuel, I feel, because we're going to be using a lot of fuel up here. However, if I don't use 6x6, we should be fine. And I don't really think we need it. Look at that. Because if I do all-wheel drive, look at that, 16 liters instead of... 8. I mean, that's a huge difference. It's twice the consumption. And not really twice the grip. So we're fine with just 4x4 and log diffs. And we'll get there to the log kiosk, drop off all the logs, and uh, we'll be able to get back to the garage, refuel, and repair. So that's going to be pretty good. And as much as I enjoy this DLC, I'm going to be kind of relieved when it's over because it's been so problematic, technically. Oh man, this... Ooh, this I'm gonna go down here and hope I don't topple. Yeah, let's do this. Oop. Take it easy. Okay, good. Oh. Okay, good. And the other truck. Should be fine as well. Uh, it's gonna be a little bit. Oh no, come on. Should not have stopped there. Lock the diffs. There we go. Perfect. I mean, it wasn't perfect, but... Wait, why is this the objective? What, are they replanting trees here? Is that it? I guess? I 
guess that's it. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Oh, I'll need all the right. There we go. Okay. Unload. Perfect. That's that. Alright, keep going. Get the other truck there. And not let it topple. Uh, uh, truck. Away from the bloody screen again. Unload. There. Okay, that's that one. Now we have to get back to the garage. Jeez, man. Alright, we need to turn around. Oh, oh, brilliant. Thanks, thanks. Alright, let's uh, restart the game. Alright, let's do this. Actually, I could... Oh, there's nowhere to winch. Oh, that's gonna be... It's not gonna be the best. Alright, let's go into this. Long diffs. And pull just slightly every now and then. To, uh, to turn more sharply. But I gotta be careful I don't topple the truck. There, perfect. Perfect. Alright. Let's get over here. Stub the truck. And let's get the other one. Oh, okay, fine. Please don't crash when I pr press F1. Alright. Got the camera. I'm also gonna try and to turn more sharply. Just a little bit of gas here and now. Let the wind do its thing. I'm not even pressing the gas pedal in here, it's just... Okay, that should be fine. Perfect. Perfect. Alright. And we're behind this truck, and now the convoy has sort of flipped. Now this truck is behind. I'm going to place it a little bit closer than last time because I don't want... No, it's gonna crash again. <sighs> Come on. <sighs> this is without a doubt... Look, look, everything's reset again. This is without a doubt the least stable game I have ever tried recording. This is truly... Truly ridiculous. Truly ridiculous. I don't even have to pull the winch. Well, maybe I will. Ah, oh, so frustrating. Just really, really incredibly unstable. Absolutely ridiculous. Is it gonna crash again? Damn. Just really, truly, insanely unstable. There's crashes, there's graphical anomalies, there's wiping of progress. It's just... I've got no words. I love this game to bits, but oh man! You know, it's... this is not normal. They need to do something about this stuff. Right, so we're back here again. Bring the truck over. Change to the other one. Hopefully the game doesn't crash again. Catch the other truck. Oh. Alright. Oh yeah. Gotta place my markers down so I know where we're going. We're just going straight through here. Alright, that's pretty good. Let's go. Power! More power! Now we'll just have to go to low gear and lug the diffs when needed. Actually, we need it now.
That guy's tailgating me. <laughs> uh, uh, so prone to crashes. Insane. It would definitely be easier just using one truck, but it would be a lot slower, of course. And at this point, I'm just... I'm just kind of hoping we get to the end of this, because... Oh, man. This is not fun to record when you try to put a video together and you have to put, like, 20 bloody pieces, some of which might be corrupted together just to get one part. It's, it's ridiculous. I don't want to actually be over there because I might tip over. What if I turn off the... Well, yeah. It's fine without uh, lock diffs. Might actually be able to go faster here. Uh, a little bit, yeah. It's gonna bog down there again because it's... Because it's muddy. Come on. I, I, I don't have to be frugal with um, with the fuel here. We're very close to the garage anyway. There's a lot of stumps here, which I have to be careful about. Oh, geez, there's a stump right there, actually. I didn't notice that one. Oh, this could be a little bit tricky. Come on. The truck in the rear. Oh, oh come on. Just don't do this to me. I might have to detach that truck in the back. Uh, let's see how it goes. Will it go through? It will. Perfect. Perfect. That was actually a lot... A lot painless than I thought it would be. A lot less painful, that's for sure. Just don't crash on me again. Please. <laughs> and look, they, they made a nice little... Uh, bridge for us as well. That's very kind of... What the heck happened there? What was that? It was like all blurry all of a sudden. Was that? Oh, weird. It's probably the camera spazzing out. Where is the garage? Okay. Still have to keep going. Come on. Just put it into bloody second gear and step on it, man. Dimitri! Use one of your 13 uh, legs to step on the gas pedal. I know it's difficult to find which one it is, but come on. That's why you have two heads. To think twice is hard. Let's go, Dimitri. We're almost at the garage over there. We'll be able to have some nice uh, Rentgen vodka. Please, I hope that log will not block us too much. Come on. We just need power. I'll put all-wheel drive on. Come on. No, no. Oh. Of course it will. Power! Power! Yeah! There we go. 6x6 six six and uh, locking diffs solve everything. Lovely. There we go. Yeah. All right. Finally back to the garage. Time to repair. Man, this truck has a lot of damage, actually. Alright. Excellent. Let's change to the other truck as well. There we go. Alright, now. We have to figure out where we're going. Actually, I'm probably going to use the other truck uh, to be first because it's got the crane and I want it to uh, park in front. All right, so we've got fuel over there if we would need it, but we got a, we have a utility trailer there, so we don't need that. Now I'll have to... No, we can actually go through this because it's, it's not really radioactive here enough to cause damage. And then we'll go down here. And... I suppose we can go over here and possibly take a little bit of damage there. Oh no, wait. Look, that's over here, so we can't go there gonna be too radioactive it's gonna have to be down here and then through here I suppose somehow uh, and then we'll swing around like this I guess all right oh excuse me ok 
Okay, let's attach the other truck. No. Yeah. Boo, 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 boo. Oh, that's still firing up that power. Yeah, speed. Like it. That, uh, that lock has disappeared. That was interesting. 23 liters a minute. Jeez. We're all going that fast. Okay, so we're just going... Oh, look at that! You see the glowing mushrooms? That's pretty cool. I like that. Excellent! Oh, this is nice. No radioactivity here. I like it. And all these pretty glowing mushrooms. I just have to follow the rail tracks. I'm actually, whoa. I'm actually surprised. I was gonna. The rear truck is having problems getting on the rails. Come on, come on, buddy. Just turn. There you go. Well, somewhat. 20 liters a minute. This is not that much slower. I think he's like sliding a little bit. Where is it? Does it still have the trailer? Yes, it does. Okay. For a moment there, I didn't. I, I thought I didn't see the trailer anymore. Um. Okay, so now we'll have to turn right here somewhere, right? Yeah. Oh, geez. Um, here, perfect, perfect, look at that, fits like a glove, nice, oh, that was great, we've avoided all of the radioactivity, that was perfect, plug the diffs because it's muddy here, uh, yeah, we don't actually need to lug the diffs, I suppose, doesn't seem to make much of a difference, though, in fuel consumption. In fact, it seems to reduce it because I suppose the wheel or the wheels are spinning somewhat slower. I don't know. the The way this game deals with throttle and such, if you're using pedals, it's very weird and it's not very satisfying. And wait, there should be a trailer where that black mark is. Oh God! There it is. Is the game gonna crash all of a sudden? Oh God! Everything is just going crazy. I don't like that. Can I refuel from this? Are you serious? I cannot refuel from this because it's not attached to something? Oh, oh come on. Ugh. Fine. Yeah, we'll have enough. We'll have enough fuel for this. Come on. Ugh. All right. Oh shoot! That's the ah no! That's the objective. That's not. The <laughs> ah. Okay. Anyway. That's uh. Yeah. Okay. My bad. We have to go to the log kiosk. Anyway, have a good one, everyone. I'll see you next time. And uh, we seem to have lost our truck, which is now invisible. Nice. Bye-bye.